Good morning everyone. It's Anne here from Anne Makes here on YouTube and this morning I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you. I stopped at Dollar Tree yesterday afternoon. Yes. And uh, my Dollar Tree still has lots and lots of boxes that are unopened and empty shelves. They had opened a few of the boxes since the last time I had been there so I was able to score a few of the Halloween goodies. And I did need a few specific items, so that's why I was there. But I didn't have a lot of time. But despite that, I did do pretty good. I did haul quite a lot. So uh, for the first part, I'm going to show you the snacks, the food, and the cleaning products and some beauty items that I got. So I can uh, leave those here in the main part of my house and I can put them away after. And uh, then I'm going to shoot a second part of this video. Uh, downstairs in my craft room where I can show you all the goodies that I haul that are more, more fun. Yeah, more fun stuff. So by the way, uh, if you want to see some of the projects that I'm making with many of the things I'm hauling from Dollar Tree, I have tutorials and uh, projects on my blog at nmakes.blogspot.com. And uh, writing those blog posts are very time consuming. So I'm a little bit short on time these days to do both the blog posts and a video. So right now they're just, that's where you'll find my projects. I'm also, full disclaimer here, am doing a few blog posts that I'm being paid for uh, by Dollar Tree. So uh, yeah, so of course I'm using uh, their products to do those Halloween crafts. And I have also commitments with other um, clients and companies right now. So that's why there's a lot of things on my blog versus my uh, YouTube channel. So please uh, go check that out if you're interested and please uh, follow me there as well. I would appreciate that. And now let's take a look see at uh, the snackies I got, okay? So here are a lot of the snacks I got. The usual are uh, as per requested for my, my family. I got them some chips. Uh, these are the ripple potato chips, the go-to snacks kind. And also a bag of ketchup chips for my ketchup chip fan. A box of this gourmet select pasta salad. Um, my son loves to eat this at lunchtime, so I got another box. Some Powerade, again for my son. Red Rain energy drink for hubby. Twizzlers, uh, I love Twizzlers, and so does my elder son and my husband, so everybody's happy now. <laughs> I bought a bottle of the uh, LA Awesome Oxygen Orange cleaner this bottle is apparently 50% more it's a 32 fluid ounce bottle it's a pretty good deal for $1.25 and it does uh, clean it does do a very good job and some nasty cleaning jobs some hand soap this is something I buy all the time uh, a can of air freshener these are this one says for bathroom air freshener that's exactly what I bought it for and I was running low on uh, bars of soap, and I do like the Olay kind. I usually buy the big package at Costco. I do find it uh, a better deal there. But since I'm running low and I know I don't have the time to go to Costco this week, I just picked one up at Dollar Tree. And here's what I thought was a great find for me. Uh, they had just put out these e.l.f. Uh, blotting shine eraser blotting sheets so and i think these are worth more than a dollar 25 <laughs> so i stocked up on a few and i'm trying to see there are yeah there are 30 sheets in each little box here so i think this was worth my trip to the dollar tree so hang in there and if you're interested to see all the crafty goodies and decorating things i purchased uh that's coming up Hi everyone, I'm back uh, with the rest of the Dollar Tree haul that I started filming uh, upstairs. Now I'm in my current uh, craft room slash studio slash <laughs> looks like it got hit by a mini hurricane. <laughs> I 
no, that's not funny, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's quite a mess in here. There's been a lot of stuff going on. So what else did I haul from uh, Dollar Tree this week? I got a few more of these little drawers that are stackable and I've seen people gluing these together to make bigger storage units and I had an idea in mind of doing something similar for my own uh, storage purposes and I actually forgot what that idea was but uh, I know it'll come back to me and if it doesn't I know I will use these somehow somewhere for storage. Of course while I was there I picked up a couple of these uh, boxes the shoe boxes with the white lids you know me and storage I love story uh, organizing and I love using plastic storage containers for a lot of things so I just picked up a couple more oh here's a bottle of soap that should have stayed upstairs <laughs> this is soap I haul uh, every week and the bowl, black cherry Merlot, uh, 15 ounces, and yeah, so it's my go-to. I got that. A couple more of the little pink drawers. Uh, my Dollar Tree had just uh, had some new ones. They had purple, blue, and green also this week. So I, I don't know if they've been keeping them hidden away and they just took them out, or if they just received a new shipment. But uh, yeah, it was new to me. I, in the Halloween stuff, sorry, okay, sorry, in the Halloween stuff, I got the googly eyes, googly, that's why I call them googly eyes, the really big ones here, these look like cookie monster eyes, <laughs> um, and I just thought they, I might have fun with these for some Halloween decorating or for any time of year actually um yeah i got that don't know what i'll do with the next two items i'm going to show you are so cute if you have a little girl i do not have a little girl i have a kitty but i don't think sh well let's try hmm <laughs> Let's see if Kitty will wear these now. Seriously, I bought these for the fabric, but look at this. It's a little skirt, little tulle orangey skirt with the little um, sparkles. It's just, you know, it's a little ruffle here. It's cute little costume for uh, children's, you know, dress up or for Halloween. So the, I got this one in the orange and I got this one in this black with gold and it has these if you can see that it's quite shiny spider webs and skulls and skeletons and i just thought i wanted to get this for the fabric because i thought this is you know this is tool uh, i'm not sure how i can i'm going to use this or if i'm actually going to use it this year but i just thought this I, had, I looked beyond basically the uh, skirt in the Halloween costume just for the material itself. But if you do know a little girl that likes to dress up or need uh, a very inexpensive Halloween getup, check out your Dollar Tree. And also, by the way, I know that on in the U.S., DollarTree.com has Halloween costume things that you can order online. And I also, uh, I've been wanting to get this for a few weeks now for some projects that I have upcoming. Um, some spider webbing. So I did get that with the little spiders. So, got that. Oh, this was new at my Dollar Tree and I snagged two of these up because I thought these are really, really practical to have in the workshop and in my own working area. It is an eight by 12 inch angle square. Uh, this is a ruler. It is very strong metal. And uh, this is great when you need to cut straight pieces and you know, it has, it has to be precise. Um, I use these also for drawing and for cutting thick pieces of cardboard. They're just, um, they're just really 
practical to have at a dollar twenty-five. Wow. I mean, if you know a a crafty person or uh, someone who likes to work with wood or is a carpenter, uh, this is a nice little stocking stuffer or just an add to or a, just because I thought of you gift. Um, very handy to have and a very good price. I bought a bag of the black sand. It doesn't look black like that. Yeah, with the plastic, it does. It is black. It's black sand and uh, some very more like charcoaly kind of gravel pebbles. That is also for a, another project that I wish to make for uh, Halloween decorating. Keeping in, keeping in mind uh, home decor, Halloween, fall decor, and all that, I grabbed a bag of the reindeer moss, kind of fluffy and green, and a bag of the Spanish moss a different color and a bag of the floral moss so different kinds of mosses for different kinds of uh, effects and uh, these you know these of course are great in floral arrangements leaf making fairy garden making uh, you can even use these to uh, lots of crafting possibilities with this and you'd be surprised at the amount that you get in these bags because they're they're squished into here so when you get it out it's kind of like poofs <laughs> so you, you get a lot for your for your money in here oh this little guy yay last week i well actually today i'm going to show you what i bought last week at dollar tree also um from the Halloween section there wasn't a lot so I just waited until this week to put it all together I did haul one of these last week it's in my bag there but I saw another one yesterday so I now I have two of the little black kitties for Halloween you know I love cats and this little guy holding a pumpkin so I just thought they were really 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 cute they do have other figurines I saw I believe was the bride of Frankenstein and um, jack-o'-lantern I think and uh, actually I can't remember but there's uh, other of these cute dangly characters you can sit them on the shelf and their little legs dangle like this or do anything else with them but I just wanted the kitty I picked up a couple packages of the uh, 20 pieces of a fastener dots in the crafter square yeah, Crafter Square um, brand, and these are little Velcro dots, and these are really handy to have for doing all sorts of, you know, projects around the house and crafting, you name it. These are the kind that you have to glue onto your project, or staple, or so. so. They're just a nice little size. I picked up a package of the Halloween erasers. Of course, because there's a kitty, I really wanted it for that. There's actually two kitty cats. So pretty happy about that. And this may go into another Halloween Dollar Tree type of project. I picked up these notepads. I thought these were really fun. I see you. I saw Tina yesterday um, when I watched a video she hauled the ones with the jack-o'-lanterns. I didn't see those. All I saw at my Dollar Tree were these ones. I see you. And I just, these were fun. So, uh, you, know, those, you know, these make great little gifts. You can put these in loot bags, Halloween, trick-or-treater bags, um, pocket letters. You know, they're just fun. I just, I just like them. That. My Dollar Tree had stuff that's from like last year on clearance for 50 cents. I did get a few items uh, last week and this week I picked up these things. I'm not even sure what they are. They are party favors. I got these yeah for 50 cents. There's four in here and I, I'm actually not sure what these are but I thought they were funny looking. Uh, kind of cute and 
might end up in a Halloween decoration or I could always give them to the kids at uh, Halloween. So uh, the story is, last week I went into my Dollar Tree. I knew they had these, but they were still wrapped in a box. And yesterday, the box was there, but someone had opened it. So I just grabbed the pumpkin from the box. Because <laughs> I'm concerned that by the time the stuff gets on the shelves, I something might happen and I might not be able to get back to the store to go get... Uh, the stuff from the shelves, so I, I can't. I'm getting what I can while I can. And I got this. I got this one lonely little corn. It was on a shelf all by itself. I don't know if they will have more at my store or not. I've seen other people haul these, and I wanted to check them out for myself. And I find these are really pretty because they're, they're like they're sparkly. They're like glass beads to make this, this corn. This funky corn. Uh, I think it's very pretty actually and uh, hopefully my Dollar Tree will put more out because otherwise this is gonna look kind of funny <laughs> on its own unless I stick it into some sort of big floral uh, arrangement or wreath decoration. This is not a crafty item but it was in my bag with my crafty stuff. It is a little manicure set like this. I haven't opened it yet and I will though and yeah. so here's a little manicure set and it opens like this and here you go ta-da so yeah that's it get the little uh, oops the nail clippers and the little nail scissors file tweezers and another little tool there got a cuticle pusher I guess so um, hmm. yeah maybe not the highest quality of course as you would expect in these little manicure sets but I like the little carrier for them so got one of these uh, I picked up some more ribbon uh, this time in the orange and black it is the sheer ribbon I wanted this. I did buy some other ribbon uh, last time or a couple weeks ago, um, but I really wanted to get the sheer one for the other uh, project that I have in mind involving Kitty. So <laughs> I was happy to find the ease yesterday. I have a huge mess of glitter all over my workspace on my house right now because these were put into the bag with everything else, including my elf blotting sheets. So, uh, yes, I picked up these sparkly branches. I got some in black last week. I think they're over in that bag over there. <laughs> and yesterday I picked up the purple and the orange. These are just lovely for some kind of um, arrangement or decoration got those oh there's glitter there's glitter everywhere so here are the black sparkly branches that my Dollar Tree had last week they didn't have any this week uh, they only had the orange and the purple that I just showed you um, so I'm glad that I bought these last week because I don't know if that's all they got and that's all they're getting I have no idea but uh, I got these and uh, last week Dollar, my Dollar Tree had these black roses with the spiders inside and I think this was the only one that had purple spiders and I got that there's actually just one rose on this thing I don't this is the only one that they had and they had the black ones here all black so I bought these last week um, and yesterday they didn't have any more of the black, but they had purple ones with black spiders. So uh, I bought the purple ones. So uh, I don't know how my Dollar Tree works, but anyway, uh, I'll just keep going back because I know there's lots of boxes that haven't been opened yet. Oh, here's the first kitty I hauled. So now I have two, two little kitties. Doo, doo, doo. Here is a package of the eyeballs. They're like 
or tiny ping pong ball with an eye on them. These are fun to use for decorating at Halloween. I could always use an extra hand. So I got two extra hands. They're actually not the same color. I just noticed that, but that doesn't matter. So uh, give me a hand. Okay, I'm cheesy. I got these skeleton hands again for a project I have in mind. Here's some chain. So, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, well, they're plastic, so I won't be able to hold back much with this. So, um, but uh, yeah, I've got some Halloween, some of these funky looking chains to make some. It's great for a costume, it's great for decorating. And here's the shiny ribbon I was telling you about before that I hauled last week. So I'll be, I'll still be using this in some uh, projects for sure. And last week I looked out that there was a lot of clearance stuff, uh, probably things from last year. So they had a whole bunch of tombstones. Uh, and these are funky. These are funny. Uh, so for 50 cents, I got uh, this one. This is creepy. I got this one that says tricks and treats and oh I love this is my favorite one rest in pieces so got that one and we do we do make a graveyard outside our house we have a spot uh, near the house that um, doesn't get a lot of sun so as the summer progresses and the shade gets strong <laughs> or the grass like completely dies so it's a perfect spot for ha and halloween to make a graveyard so that's what we do so we'll have our we'll have more tombstones to add to our graveyard this year <laughs> and finally but not least i bought some more of the glass bottle because my dollar tree had a whole bunch of these last week and believe it or not this week the shelves have dwindled to like half um, they had all these beautiful colors. I could not resist, so I got one like this. It's it's beautiful, dark orangey color, and it has some designs on it, um, which I'm not sure what this is exactly. I was going to say it looks like pine cone, but I don't think it is. It might be thistle. I, I It's really hard to tell what this is supposed to represent, but it's, it's a lovely bottle. I got the green one. This is a shape that I really like this nice yellow one oh, so actually I got actually I got two of the green two of the yellow and I think they'll make a very lovely uh, display for autumn fall uh, Halloween and yeah so uh, yeah that's it for my Dollar Tree haul a uh, little bit last week a bigger haul yesterday all put together and I like I have mentioned at the beginning of the video uh, a lot of these things are going to end up in some projects that I am making specifically I am making some projects for Dollar Tree uh, and uh, so those will be the tutorials for those will end up on my blog if I have the time before the end of the month I will also make videos but that might be delayed till October because I have to get these blog posts out before September 30th Oh, that's my deadline. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed uh, this haul, and I've, I hope I've given you some like, creative ideas to get crafty this fall. And I just want to say that right now, our weather is just absolutely gorgeous. It is beautiful outside. It is warm. It hasn't been this warm in September in ages, and it's like the warmest September ever. It's even warmer now than it was in August. So uh, we want to enjoy it because our summer was a wash, uh, it was a complete bust. We had so much rain and it was cold, it was not nice. So we are trying to enjoy these beautiful days that we have right now in September. Uh, and uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go outside a little bit, just enjoy the beautiful sunshine. And I hope wherever you are, you are safe. Uh, that you have decent weather that you can uh, live with and um, thank you so much for watching this video thank you for supporting my channel and my blog and I hope you'll give this a thumbs up please like comment share and take care of yourself and I will catch you after the next haul bye